to, to death. There's there's nothing. Welcome back to the show. Uh, as we were just talking, there is actually no word for thirsting to death. Um, dying of dehydration is all you're allowed to say. <laughs> Uh, Great way to start the show. Just Great yeah. way. Do you guys know there's no proper Wh word for murder? <laughs> <laughs> I put that on Game of Thrones. <laughs> yeah. I mean, there is actually a word for fucking your siblings, though. So, I mean, hey, you win some, you lose some. Wow. Welcome to the show, everybody. <laughs> hey, look. Shoot it. Shoot it. What? Shoot it. It's a... oh. <laughs> I am the greatest hunter you have ever seen. I love the blood spurts. <laughs> Do anything with them? No, you just kill them. These aren't deer. What the hell? Good God! <laughs> I was wrong. I was like, no, they're no. not. They have like beards <laughs> and horse faces. Yeah, they're probably like goat deer. I am Audi. Or goat demons. I can't jump off. I can't. See? Why can I not just fucking jump off a cliff? Yeah, into the water. Because they didn't want to program fall damage, I it's guess. It's bullshit. You're bullshit. No, I'm not. Okay. Whoa, look, it's water! Hey, it's fish. Duh, I, can I, why the fuck? I just want to stab him. With, with, with your bow? No. With your feet? You'd stab him with your feet. Look, <laughs> yeah, these things are monstrosities. I'm... Oh, yeah. I'm glad that I have limit. Some reagents are more difficult to harvest than others. They're used for alchemy. No reagents found. Yeah, you, you basically like roll the dice as to whether or not. Wow. By the way. <laughs> Ow! Ow! Bad dog! No! No! Oh, I, no! Oh. No! No! Loop the wolf. It had seven gold coins and a sky blossom. Just for you. Why do... Um, well, I'm pretty sure he has gold because he just ate a dude. I mean, dudes usually have gold. You've discovered a new location. I don't care. Ba -da -ba -ba -da -ba. That's okay. Is this the right way? Probably. I mean, you know, whatever. I don't... I mean, you do have a waypoint, but... Oh, yeah. I mean, if you want to explore the cave, you can. Yeah, caves are pretty great. I wonder what they're trying to keep out slash in. Slash in. It's the hash-bringing slasher. The... The cash slinging crasher. Flash tinging. Tash tinging. Bash binging. Oh, it's a kobold! Oh, you just got shot with a thing! Why is that inconvenient? I mean, well, that's because you don't have the MLG speed. You might want to eat a health potion. Fuck, God! Oh my God, did I die? Yeah. I, I told you to eat a health potion. I, I did it. I pushed the button as soon as you told me. Well, I don't believe you. You gonna load last save? Do we have to start all over? No, it auto saves. Oh, thank God. I'm just kidding. It starts all over. Dude, I don't know. Don't fuck with me on this. Okay. I go, well, I mean, you'll probably find out here in a second. Oh, I loaded my save. <laughs> Guess you don't have a character anymore. Fuck. <laughs> I think it's time that I was done with this game for a little while. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, th this is my fireman. She uses a staff and then fire chakra. Yeah, you know what? Why don't you just play? <laughs> And uh, I'll watch and cry. I mean, I guess I could, I could just play this high-level character. Oh, also, you can turn off um, friendly fire. So, like, uh... <laughs> I can crit and murder. Oh, oh, are you ready for the charged staff? Boom! 
dude. You there, halt! Um, I'm gonna resist arrest. Going to make trouble, are you? <laughs> yeah. Going anywhere. <laughs> By the way, don't kill me. Guards are really powerful. Anyway, so, uh, that was a fun game, yeah? I can't <laughs> believe it didn't autosave once for me. Yeah, I mean, I guess that happens. But, uh... I mean, yeah, we apparently have you. It just loaded my game for no reason, I guess. So, uh... This is my warrior. She's uh, got a giant hammer. The hammers are sick, by the way. So, uh... You can have your character back, I guess. I don't know. Do you? Oh, good! Good! Getting the fuck out of here, I learned my <laughs> lesson. Yeah. You learned that daggers don't do shit for damage. They're for stealthing. You need fey blades. What is that? Is that nuts? I want some of your nuts. Yeah, just reach into my crotch. Okay. The, the cashews are pretty delicious. Ooh. <laughs> they're shaped like... Well, I mean, they're also shaped like, uh, you know... They're phallic. In what? Look, okay, look, well, some... Look at that. Some penis. Or, you know, it's not erect. Yes, Durr. Shut up, man. Oh my god, it's the Great Warden from Dragon Age. Look at this high-level, like, paladin or some shit. I don't even know. You've come from the tower! <laughs> <laughs> he just has this, like, Well, oh, hey there, guys! <laughs> He's Toad. What's a Fate Weaver? Actually, that's you. Sorry. What's a Fate Weaver? Hughes sent me to find you. There's trouble at the tower. Yeah, I don't really give a shit about anybody. So, yeah. Did he? Poor old for Morris Hughes! He's respected the way the world works! What a shame! He's probably dead now! What do you know about Hughes? What makes you think he's dead? The cards told me- The cards told me that the Well of Souls would work, but Hughes' success would come on the day of his death! He took it pretty well, honestly. He took it pretty well, honestly. We did a lot of drinking after that, though. <laughs> <laughs> Things got a bit weird, and then we, uh, kind of made out a bit. It was weird he's a gnome. He's very tiny. But, uh, I mean, hey, anything looks big in a gnome's hands, am I right? success. <laughs> Whichever. Oh, my God. <laughs> Not only have we now implied that this man has a thing for gnomes, but that he has an abnormally small penis. <laughs> well, I mean, we've the created gods? quite the in-depth character already. The heart of the cards? Yugi, is that you? <laughs> you really don't know much, do you? So you are, Yugi Moto. <laughs> I will draw the cards. <laughs> but you can't do that! I'm the Kaiba. I own all three blue eyes, white dragons. There are four. I ripped up the fourth because you're an asshole and your grandpa doesn't like even playing card games. Yeah, sure, she like, what the fuck? Why did you have it? Dude, Yugi's grandpa? Yeah. Well, I mean, Yugi's grandpa just sort of had it because, uh, I mean, he used to play a lot. And then, there you go. Look at the speed dodging. Oh, that's okay, <laughs> I was dead too. <laughs> The cards are unique to each Fate Weaver since we all see the weave differently. <laughs> That's a good, I was dead too. You? You're the one? Then that means it all makes sense now. The cards this morning. The cards this morning. I drew the Grave Digger, the Running Man, and the Beast. That means that someone's going to dig up your old grave and then have sex with your body like a beast. And it's bestiality, but it's necromancy. No, necromancy. <laughs> Gross. Necromancy, necromandu. Da -da 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 -da. Yep, you gather fate energy from me. So that's your purple bar. Hurt, hurt. You wanna fight? You wanna fight? Dude, fight him, bro. 
Dude, oh, you got this. Just shoot him, shoot him. Yeah, there you go. Shoot, shoot that, shoot that guy. Look, look at you. Alright, now it's about to show you fate mode. When your fate meter's full, you can enter reckoning mode. L the triggers. Let me show you what it is to be a man! Just use your fucking daggers. Fuck! And then once you've damaged them all, press A. Boom! Mm, I like eating your fate weaves, shit. What? How? What are you? How I'm did you do that? Man. The threads of fate, I've seen them before, but I've never seen anyone actually, like, make the cat's cradle with the threads. You just changed. I can't even, I can't even fathom how talented you are. You ever do this for a living before in your previous life? You just fate will be of the gods. No one should be able to change it. How is that even possible? Possible. Come here. I'm going to come here. I'm going to do a reading. You might be able to change the threads, but the fate will still have a plan for you. I promise not to. I promise not to tell you if I see your death. Ha 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 ha. I'd I'd rather not see my death. Thank you very much. Besides, how can anyone kill me when I have this fabulous mustache? Some people paint landscapes. Some people paint landscapes! Other write poetry! I peer into the weave of fate's tapestry and see people's deaths! Deaths. Wow. That would be- That would be my guess! He was an academic, but he had proper respect for fate's plan! Unlike most gnomes, because they don't believe in the hocus pocus shit! I don't believe in fate. I make my own. That's what? But how? You're the only one that can manipulate fate, the threads. But that doesn't mean you can make your own fate, right? Okay. So wait, that whole choice was both thread in the going to show me the cutscene anyway? Pretty much. Wow, thanks. Fuck off. It takes you. Or at least... Yeah, I mean, that being said, this game kind of is a piece of shit. But I like playing it because it's fun. And like, once you get past, because it starts so fucking slow. But like, it's pretty fun later on once you get like all this cool shit, and there's like cool enemies and stuff. But, uh, yeah, this game's pretty much a piece of shit. Fate's weave is always hard to see. It's in motion, hard to make out, but undeniably there. Riveting. It's just <laughs> missing. Hey, what the fuck is that blue ass symbol? Everybody I talk to? Oh, that's. That's like the symbol of like fate or whatever, because it's like the tarot cards and then it's like the little swirlies. I'm not saying I, I don't even know, but um. Why does it show up when I'm trying to talk to somebody? It it shows up because that means that you're talking to the uh, you're talking to the main quest person. The like because you have main quests and you have like side quests. Oh, so, so that means like that like what quest I'm on. Right. Okay. So like if it's the main storyline, it'll have that little symbol. You have to go to unlock to decimate. Destiny. You wanna be a rogue? You wanna be an acolyte? You wanna be a brawler? That's what, no. Wow! I'm sorry, that was unnecessarily <laughs> hostile. Ouch! I apologize. Well, I mean, I almost always wanna be a mage, so, I mean... I'm really Dude, bad at stop video. fucking eating nuts and texting, play the fucking game. And sometimes, a lot. It takes you gotta eat so many nuts. Can't stop putting nuts. What did you see, you crazy man? You're terrible at this. <laughs> it could mean nothing, or it could mean everything. The world is changing. It could mean nothing, or it could mean everything. Wow, thanks. To be or not to be. Well, who the fuck cares? Should consult with Arden. He's not a friend, but he's got a good eye for the tapestry.
I'll meet you at his you the fate. Avatar. Sorry, I forgot. You're called the Fateless One. Because you don't have a fate. Can you make your own destiny? Get it? It's because you're a player character. Everyone else is NPCs, so they're already set in stone. Not played. But I've seen a lot of, like, a lot oh, of that shit. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> like, hey. I don't know. <laughs> it's all the same story. It's really hilarious. He lives in a little hut to the east in Yolvin. I'll meet you there. Yolvin? Whoa. What? So do you want to keep playing this piece of shit, or do you want to move on? Um, I don't know. To be perfectly honest with you, the combat's kind of nice. I like fighting. <laughs> he, he's the main character, bro. You can't. Okay. Um. Story. Yeah. Um. Yeah. I mean, this did come out like, I think, four years ago. So I mean, it's it's okay. Like I said, it's very like World of Warcraft. Fix. It's a lore stone, bro. Doing anything? You walk up to it and press A. <laughs> oh. <laughs> and then it just tells a story. Like it's like uh, if you ever played Borderland, pick up one of the recorders. That's what lore stones are. But yeah. All right. Uh. So I guess we're just probably gonna be done with this piece of shit. Game review time. So um, gra graphics, uh, seven out of ten. Uh, fighting, ten out of ten. Uh, story, uh, who gives a shit? Out of who cares? Um, and there we go. Boom. Game review done. Things yeah. I probably just passed like a bunch. Yeah. Yeah. You you passed up. Buggers! Oh whoa. god! Oh, whoa! Whoa! Why are they so fast? Wait a minute. Is that the friggin' Deku symbol on their map? No, not the Deku symbol. It's, I guess it might be similar. It looks like know. the Swirly on the Deku shield. Maybe they're from the Hidden Leaf Village. No, the Na Naruto. They got the Swirly from Naruto on no, the forehead. From the Get Deku. it? It's it's from the it's from the Konoha. He's one of the gods. Too bad, you already prayed at his shrine. Dang. You know, um, you would have been sent here anyway if you'd have picked up the fucking quest. Well, maybe I'll just save the town of my own fucking intuition. No, no, too bad. Look, a rock. Open that door. So are the enemies appropriate? I don't know, maybe. Fuck everything. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, oh, look at that guy. He's a Red Legion archer. She <laughs> was. Stab, 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 stab. Fucking. <laughs> hey. This guy. Oh. Oh God. Oh. Oh my gosh! That's kind of brutal. I love how you just like stab her, and then he's just like, "Oh, what's over there, slightly to the right, that I could totally see this into my peripheral?" That's like some Assassin's Creed Three shit. Yeah, dude, this game came out long before Assassin's Creed Three too. This was an ins this is inspired Assassin's Creed Three. <laughs> <laughs> this game oh, right here. Oh fuck! They made Assassin's Creed Three because they saw this game and they were like, "All right, so I, I love that you're going here." But I'm I'm gonna need you to make more assassins. That that's what happened. With Assassin's Creed 3. They saw this game and they were just like, you know, if every character was a rogue character, this game would be perfect for our next game. So then they made Assassin's Creed 3, which was basically this game, but everybody was um rogues. I'll tell something about America. Exact setting. And yeah, um, yeah. Oh yeah, ex ex that, um, exactly the same. Yep, yeah, that's including the main character. Yep, and there's also eagles everywhere. Just every animal would turn into an eagle. Every animal, especially yep. the horses. Yep, the horses just turned into eagles with the hooves. Ooh. Brownies.
Yeah. That's for construction of swords. Ooh. Nice. So that means that you can make a sword that has a uh, frost. Sometimes this is too hard to believe. But you can accept it. Yep. Okay, so um, next time on the show, we're probably gonna be done playing this fucking game. So Harvest Eel they delivered themselves into the So um <clears throat> well, let's get your review of this game before we end it out. The future brings the forming storm. Uh, sure. Like 10 out of 10. Well, all right, um, so how, how do you, what do you think this game was? How do you like it? Um, well, yep, yep, was, sure. Um, I think, well, you told, um, I would, I can't bring myself. Yeah. I mean, also, this isn't really the setting to care. We're just kind of assholes being assholes. So, you know, if, if we were alone, oh man, we would probably care a little bit. Oh, yeah, I'd probably care. Oh, yeah. It's so good. I mean, the graphics are so hot. Yeah. Did you see that brownie? Oh, mm. oh God, look at that. Oh, oh, yeah. Oh, uh, 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 oh it's, you can even put a gem in it. See that weapon socket? 